Base64 is used everywhere. It is the most known and famous encoding scheme that is used to represent binary data and transform it into an ASCII representation. Why do we use it? What is the algorithm and how does it actually work? Coming up. We use Base64 as a method to encode binary data into an ASCII representation. Why do we do so? We do so since many systems, many networks just don't represent binary data as it is supposed to be shown. So how does it actually work? So let's do it by example. Let's take the word 48. Each character has an 8-byte representation. So if we will convert each character into its own ASCII binary representation, we will see, for example, that the character F has a value of 102. That's the decimal value. If we convert it into a binary representation, we will get 01100110. Now, take the different bytes, the different character bytes, and regroup them in a six binary digit format. That is taking each byte, cut the last two, and add them up to the next eight bits. So by doing so, we will have six digit binary groups, more groups than we had before. Now take each group and convert it into its own decimal number. So if that's our six digit group, that's their decimal value. So now the first group is actually 25, converting it into its own decimal value. The second group is 38 and so on. Now take the base64 encoding table, which you can find just about everywhere. And each decimal value has its own representation in base64. So 25 is actually Z, 38 is actually M. Converting that, you will find out that the word 48 is actually in base 64, ZM, 9Y, D, G, L, N, Y, X, R, L. So let's do it using a Python script I actually wrote and check it out. All right, so... Let's run this script. What is your message? My message is 40 gate and it's being converted into ZM9YD, the same as we did manually using our base64 encoding table. So if we move to our 40 gate, open up our command line and use show user local you will see that the users have their password, which is actually being hashed, that is using SHA-256, if I'm not mistaken, and then it is being encoded in base64.